Renewable energy, like wind and sun, is important for reducing climate emissions. But it is not enough. The world will continue to generate too much CO2 in the future. Therefore, it is important to send the CO2 back where it came from. This climate measure is called carbon capture and storage. Currently, there are 18 major carbon capture and storage projects around the world. But we still have a long way to go. The International Energy Agency says that we need to store billions of tons of CO2 every year to reach the UN climate goals and make the world a better place. Equinor has been developing technology to make this possible for more than 20 years. We are a part of more than 40 research projects on carbon capture and storage. We have implemented the technology at two of our fields and we have stored CO2 deep below the seabed of the North Sea, equal to the annual emissions from 10 million cars. There is room for more. The seabed of the coast of Norway is well suited for storing CO2 and we can potentially store the equivalent of 1,000 years of Norwegian emissions under the North Sea. Northern Lights is a collaboration between Equinor, Toto and Shell. Our ambition is to create a CO2 storage facility on the Norwegian continental shelf. Here's how it works. Emissions from large industrial facilities onshore are captured and transported to a reception plant northwest of Bergen in Norway. From here, the emissions are pumped through pipelines into a rock formation three kilometers beneath the seabed for secure storage. Carbon capture and storage is an industry for the future, but close collaboration is necessary. Public authorities and the business community must work together to develop incentives, infrastructure and jobs so that carbon capture and storage can become an efficient environmental measure. If we succeed, we can start storing CO2 emissions from onshore industry and take a giant step towards achieving our common climate goals.